Hey everybody, it's Sam with Wrestling Overtime with the results show from last night's WWE Smackdown and it was coming to you from the Performance Center on March 13th, 2020 and let me remind you, this is the just the Fox, the quick and easy, down and dirty, nitty gritty results show. You will be getting the Raves and Ranch show from me later today, but the show opened up with Triple H, and I thought that was interesting that Triple H wanted to show us and tell us that they were coming to us from the Performance Center with no audience, and kind of, he opened the curtain to show us that there was no audience there, which... I thought was a little unusual, but considering the times and what's going on, um, I think it was it, it was an okay thing. But they the first match of the night was uh, Sasha Banks and Bailey versus Nikki Cross and Alexa Bliss. Um, it was a pretty decent match, and Sasha ended up locking on the bank statement on Nikki Cross for the win. And then we had a unusual segment. Uh, Roman Reigns was interviewed by Michael Cole, and I'm just going to go ahead and give you um, the headline from that. He hinted that he and Goldberg were going to main event WrestleMania. And that's the first that I had heard of that. I hadn't seen that uh, anywhere. And Roman Reigns wanted to uh, talk about that. So that was basically the highlight of that promo was that interesting tidbit that we may be seeing Roman Reigns and Goldberg main eventing WrestleMania. Um, Anyway, after that, uh, WWE made an unusual decision, and they showed the Elimination Chamber pay-per-view SmackDown Tag Team Championship match in full. Um, they showed uh, the Lucha House Party going crazy. They showed all the eliminations. They showed Otis running through um, the wall and ending up on the floor. Um, they that was an interesting decision that a lot of people paid nine ninety nine for that pay per view. And less than a week later, they made the decision to show that for free. I, I have seen a lot of people already throwing fits about that, but I'm kind of glad that everybody got to see that and got to see that tag team match for what it was. And you guys can go back to my raves and rants and and see if I was right. Mojo Raleigh come out and said that Gronk has not signed yet, but will be at SmackDown next Friday. I'm going to save that one for my raves and rants and review exactly what I think of that and how it doesn't make any sense. But then we got Daniel Bryan um, versus Cesaro. How we got here was a little interesting also, and I'll save that for my raves and and rants on my review. But uh, Daniel Bryan ended up rolling up Cesaro for the win and possibly creating a new program. Uh, Then... We got to see Jeff Hardy back, and I was really excited. I actually marked out for this because he took on Baron Corbin, and Jeff hit the Swanton Bomb, of course, for the win over Corbin, and I absolutely love seeing Jeff back in a ring so quickly and not doing a promo. And then to end it, uh, John Cena come out and was going to do an interview and ended up going back and forth with Bray Wyatt. And their back and forth to end the show was probably the highlight of the show. It is actually my YouTube moment of the show. So if you didn't get to see SmackDown, you didn't get to DVR it, or you want to only see the best thing, of SmackDown from um, Friday the 13th, then the YouTube moment that you want to look up is 
the back and forth between John Cena and Bray Wyatt where they are telling you why they want to go up against each other um, in WrestleMania. And it was very good. And so I am going to leave you with that. Of course, as always, please subscribe to our broadcast. You can leave any reviews of this that you would like on Podchaser. And please come over and tell me what you think on our Facebook page and Twitter page at Wrestling Overtime. Or you can shoot me an email at WrestlingOvertime at gmail.com. I enjoy talking with our fans back and forth and getting emails with that. So I I look forward to see you guys soon. We'll be uh, putting the Raves and Rants review up very quickly and look forward to talking to you guys soon. Bye.